So I was gone for quite a while, I'm not going to lie. So in that time, I have definitely been playing football manager. I've done a Man City save. This video is inspired by Alex. Yeah, shout out Alex. He said that he's three seasons into his PSG save and he wants me to review his players. So if you want me to review any of your players from your saves, email is in the description. Um, I don't know if I'm going to make that the title of the video, but yeah. We're going to do a separate one for you guys. This one is my one. Let's go. All right, we're going to start off with the outs. Um, we've got these random guys, yeah, flipping Sammy Robinson. I guarantee you don't know who that is um, first season. I know who Cole Palmer is. He's actually very good in this game. I'm not even going to lie. Like, he's a baller still, but I had to sell him to Arsenal for £22 because they're the only team that would pay that much, yeah. Random guys, once again, you're not going to know who any of these guys are. Keiki. Um, all right, that's a loan. Cool. Yeah, there's just bare, bare random guys that we got rid of. Fernandinho is not random. £4 because he's... Definitely old, yeah, man's 37 now, but man, man sold him as well. Alexander Zinchenko, 15 million to Liverpool, got rid of him as well. Um, the main one for me was Mahrez, innit? Like, I think in this game, he is whack, bruv. Like, he's dead, bruv. So um, I had to get rid of him as well. But that's what we got out, yeah? And because you've got so much money as Man City, I got my guy, Castrovilli. He's, he's a very good player. I'm not going to lie. Like, look at his stats now. Um... I think they're pretty much identical. He hasn't really improved in anything. I liked him because of the tenacity and that he's got like mad work rate, determination and aggression. But then with that, he can actually control the ball. The only thing about him is that he can't pass, bruv. And what I mean by that is 13 passing, you can't split a defence with that. Let's be real. But anyway, um, some sick left back, bruv. Man like Calafiori, yeah, he came with 11 pace. He's now got 14, bruv, you get me? Um, man... In terms of end products is the next level. He's only 20, bro. And man's got 15 crossings, stuff like that. The only thing about him is that defensively, it can get sticky still. I'm not going to lie. I've seen him get spun numerous times, bro. It's, it's not fun still. But yeah. Um, Gato no is the one that I said that I've bought. And then Tyrick Mitchell is one of the best left backs in this game. Straight up. Like, I'm just being honest. I did not pay a lot for him. Like How much did I pay? 34 million for a guy that starts week in, week out is an absolute bargain and as you can see he's very competent playing left back brother like playing out from the back man's got 14 passing crossing 14 as well pace you're not really going to spin him and then man can tackle the ball comfortably as well he's a very good left back and then finally Erlen Haaland for 96 million um my my guy Alex told me he's got Haaland as well he said that he's the GOAT trust me Haaland's the GOAT just look at that record 42 games 40 goals bruv um it's not a joke so he's 22 now so he's getting old, as he says. But listen, man is flipping sick, bruv. One of the best players in this game, without a shadow of a doubt. Man like Erling Haaland is an absolute baller. Look at the stats, bruv. Like, everything apart from jump and reach and stamina is green in the physicals, bruv. Like, it's not a joke still. And then, obviously, the finishing ability is mad. He is a very good player, man like Erling Haaland. All right, for the second season, um, we're going to start off with the outs again. And we've got bare random Joes, bruv. I don't know who the hell these guys are, not going to lie. But we've got Kyle Walker who I scammed Real Madrid with for 26 million. I'm not going to lie, I think that's a bargain, honestly, because he's just fast, that's it. Can't even cross a ball, man, is over the age of 30. Anyway, um, Yango Herrera, I have no clue who that guy is, but I still got 10 million for him. Um, Yeah, I think that's a brilliant bit of business by myself, you get me? Um, And then that's pretty much anyone that we've sold. Everyone else is alone or irrelevant. Oh, wait, no, Nathan Ake, 30 million at the time. I thought that they got Ake for free, but it turns out that they actually paid big money for him, um, which was crazy. So I kind of regret letting him go, but he was complaining sitting on the bench, so I had to let him go anyway. And then um, I think that's it. Yeah. Ake, Marlos Moreno, no one really gives a damn who that guy is. Yeah. Nah, hey, well, what the fuck? I don't know who this guy is, but his name is Bustos and he is very bad, bruv. Okay, he's not very bad, but he's not that good. And yeah, that's pretty much everyone that we sold. But... As you can see, man got Mbappe for free, bruv. Yeah, see now, when it comes to negotiations, I'm like flipping, I'm not the best. I have to be honest, like I usually just do bare installments in it, but this time I, I done my business still. So yeah, we've got Mbappe for free now. So when you when you bolster the attack with someone like Mbappe for free, it's not a joke, bruv. Like you can see, um, he, he's not a goal scorer for me. I have to be honest, he misses so many chances, yeah. But, but in terms of assists, seven assists in nine, ten games, it's not too bad. Let's be honest, that's not bad at all. But anyway, enough of Mbappe. Man got Gavi on loan. This is Barcelona's new flipping guy and I, may, I managed to get him on loan. And it's a loan to buy as well. And I think the buying price is less than 50 million, which Barcelona, you are flipping dumb. I can't lie. They let him go, innit? They let him go still. You can see 
he is that Ilkay Gundogan replacement. That's what he is in it. Like simple as he's eighteen and he's already got stats like this. It's long. I can't lie. In the future, it's definitely long still. Right, now for the finances. Um, right now we've got three hundred million. Yeah, and I'm just saying that I think I only made fifty million from Ake and Walker, which is a decent amount. But I'm just saying. With all that money, and my team is that good, I don't need to buy anyone, so the money's just sitting there. I've asked the board for me to be able to buy a stadium. They had to tell me to fuck off. They told me to fuck off saying that, you know what, we don't have any fans, so why the hell are we going to buy a new stadium? And I could understand, I'm not going to lie, City have no fans, bruv. So, um, yeah, um, let's, let's move. All right, the tactical style that I played, yeah, before I show you, like, what man's done in the two seasons, yeah? The tactical style that I've been playing is a 4-2-3-1. Gigan press, um, and and you can see one full back, one wing back, one no not centre back, one ball playing in front on cover. The reason for that is because Poro. Well, it was Cancelo, but oh wait, I didn't even show how I got Poro. Oh my days! Wait, no, no, he was already my player. Cool. Anyway, um, Foden straight line right winger, even though he's left foot, it makes no sense, but it works. Mbappe cutting inside, Haaland up front, but as we know, this is high intensity in it. Like we've got high intensity players. You could put Haaland as pressing forward if you want to as well, but um, yeah, Gigan press is it's very broken still, and I'll show you why right now. Right now, in my first season with Manchester City, um, we just hit the ground running and we won everything apart from the Carabao Cup. Um, Community Shield, FA Cup, Premier League, Champions League, um, Super Cup as well. Yeah, we won everything apart from the Carabao Cup, so um, it's been very successful. Let's just see in depth for the league quickly. So let me tell you how um, tight the first season was. We won the league by goal difference on that first season because Liverpool are broken. Like We both won 29 games. We both drew six games. We both lost three games. But because I had Haaland and they didn't have Haaland, we won the league. Simple as. That's the only excuse. That's why we scored the most goals in the league as well. Literally because of Erling Haaland. And then next season, which is the season now, currently leading. It's only eight games in, I know, but um, we're probably going to win that again if Liverpool... Don't stop flipping winning, simple as. But yeah, that is um, what man's been doing, isn't it? Simple. So this is not a player ratings video, but I am going to quickly skim through to show you some of the stats in it after one year. Um, Scott Carson, I don't know why man's playing football. Um, we, we already know what that is. Taylor Harwood Bells is a little... Um, I think he's championship quality right now, if I'm being completely honest, but he's got good potential. Like He could potentially lead that back line in the future. He's only 20 now. Someone like Ruben Diaz, you're looking at his stats, you're like, yeah, this guy's elite. Simple as, simple, literally. Um, Pedro Porro, right wing back, can't really tackle too well, but going forward, man's got 17 dribbling. I mean, 16 dribbling and 17 flair. Um, yeah, he's, he's nuts. Man's got 14 strength and he's five foot nine. Madness, bruv. Yeah, I, I wouldn't want it from him still. And then, what, Calafari, I already showed you him. Cancelo's been injured for quite a while, but he is one of the best right backs in this game. Trust me, on wing back attack or even complete wing back attack, you can't really stop this guy. Like, he's just got the maddest and his delivery is just next level bruv um, Tommy Doyle um, I've seen him he's, he's a decent midfielder I'm not going to lie I make him a deep plan playmaker the only reason why I do that is because he can't dribble right now but I'll definitely double intensity that and yeah people like Raheem Sterling he's done his thing I have to be honest like he's, he's scored a lot of goals for me like he, he's I know he's got 30 finishing but because his movement is so good he gets a, he gets into a very good um, amount of positions De Bruyne um, self-explanatory I know he's getting old now 31 but still still very quality um, Bernardo Silva we already know man's work rate is un untouchable and yeah um, the 100 million man man like Jack Grealish he's very good I think he's a right winger though like after playing him in left wing cam um, right wing he's definitely best as a right winger um, and yeah well, Jesus he's squad depth yeah that's all I really have to show you because that's the team right there so yeah you lot, um, if you have any team that you want me to review, and I mean your own team over the years, just send in a picture of your players to my email and um, we'll sort it out from there. I'll make another video where I review your players. But yeah, that's just the same that I've been doing. So yeah, you lot, if you like that video, like that video. Um, yeah, nothing else for me to really say. If you like that video, like that video. Subscribe to the content you know what to expect from me. And I'll see you in the next episode, bruv. See you.